Hello everyone and welcome to Nancy's Magic Touch and DIYs. If this is your first time on my channel, welcome. And if it's not, thank you so much for your support in coming back. In today's video, I'm sharing with you another awesome thrift store haul for Easter. I keep finding these amazing things and I just have to share them with you. So let's get started. I got this beautiful tray. It's solid wood. It is beautiful. This is not suitable for my taste, but I'm simply going to do this over and that's all it needs. This is a perfect little tray if you want to put some peanuts or a little chocolate or something out for company or for yourself. And uh, yeah, I had to pick this up. I paid three bucks for this. I got this wooden shape carrot. I paid 50 cents for this. I wasn't going to leave that there knowing that Easter is coming. This originally would have been $10.49 and it was on sale for 50 cents. So I'm going to do a DIY with this piece for sure. I found this beautiful little pot. Um, it's got a little cover. It is perfect size for a tear tray. Uh, I'm gonna do this over for sure. These little speck of yellow and green is not working for my decor, but it is already very pretty for Easter if somebody, uh, or spring if somebody uh, uses these colors, but I'm going more neutral and I'm not liking these speck of colors. So I'm gonna do a DIY with this. And I'm thinking this is cute too for your tear tray with little greeneries in it, just to add a little touch. Um, this is definitely a cute little piece. I paid 50 cents for this. I got more wooden candlestick. Um, I will never leave these behind, no matter what. Uh, every time I go to a thrift store, I find a uh, wooden candlestick. I always bring them home. This is uh, this is such a nice thing to have on hand for some projects, for some gifts that you want to give somebody for resale as well. I paid $4.99 for the two solid wood pieces. I got this beautiful piece. Of course, this is going to get painted and this is going to be removed. Um, this is perfect for a farmhouse look and it lays flat like this. It's absolutely gorgeous. Um, the colors are not bad really, but um, the bluish, pinkish shine into it is what really drives me crazy. So I'm going to do this piece over. I paid $1.50 for this piece. Isn't it cute? Perfect for a farmhouse look for spring, Easter. This is just too cute. I got this frame. Uh, this is all solid wood. It is beautiful. Um, I paid $2 for this piece and this will be transformed as a tray. I'm possibly going to put the legs on this and make a beautiful tray out of it. I love the details here on the side. Uh, I don't often find frames with such details, so this will be transformed to a beautiful tray for sure. I got this beautiful pottery mug. This mug is perfect. Not doing anything to this mug. This is real pottery. There's a signature on the bottom. I paid $3 for this piece, but look how beautiful it is. Absolutely gorgeous. Um, I may keep it for myself, but I have special people in my life, um, an aunt, that would absolutely love this. So this may take a little trip home uh, to my aunt, maybe. I think she would absolutely adore this. I found this cute, cute little teapot. Uh, I couldn't resist it. I was looking at other thrift store and I found little teapots. They weren't as pretty as this one. They were like ranged between four and five dollars. I got this one for 75 cents. 
score. This is perfect for my tear tray. This will be so, so cute, filled with little planter or little spoons or something, but this is a perfect size for a tear tray. I got, I don't know what this is. This is remind me like something from a church or something. I don't know. I paid $3.99. It's solid wood. It's got that little ring into it. I found it really interesting. If you guys know what this is, please let me know. I'm very curious, but I'm thinking this would be very cute in a display uh, by itself in a tear tray or on a shelf or put an egg on top to decorate it or little plants, little greeneries or something. But this is a perfect size to add a touch to your tear tray as well. So I found a lot of nice little tear tray items on this trip and I was really excited because they're not easy to find. I got these beautiful wood, solid wood platter. I got four of these for $2. So this is definitely going to be a DIY. These are gorgeous. They are all hand painted. Uh, it's a shame to get rid of this. Um, this was nice back in the days, not so much today, but look how cute they are. Somebody put a lot of work to this. This might be suitable for someone's decor, but it's not for me, so it's going to be transformed for sure. Somebody, <laughs> she's holding that little pig. Isn't that cute? Anyways, I want to show you them. These are a really good score. Um, just to give you an idea, these could be nice uh, display plates for your wall, but my idea with this is probably to do some nice riser and i also have a lot of uh, cloche like um glass um cake topper uh that uh, not a cake topper what am i looking for those glass thing that goes on top of of your your cake stand uh <laughs> what is it called please let me know and put one of them on these with a riser then again you know you could use a candle holder and have a really nice riser uh, this way as well so definitely will be the purpose for these plates for me but there's multiple things that you could do with these beautiful wooden plates I found this cute little bunny of course the color is not suitable for me but I think if I do this over in the right color uh, it will be super cute. Let me know what you think of this bunny. Uh, I paid $4 for this piece and uh, it is super, super cute. It's got all the stitch. So I'm thinking I will concentrate on the stitch as a darker and possibly paint this bunny in a nice ivory or a white color. Um, so yeah, let me know what you think of this beautiful piece. It's perfect for Easter decor at the moment. I found this beautiful piece. Um, look at this, how suitable for this time of year. It's got these beautiful little eggs on it. It needs a good cleanup and I'm possibly gonna do a little update to it. I paid $7 for this piece and I just couldn't leave it behind because uh, it's just too perfect for Easter. So I'm going to do a little touch up to this, but not too much. I'm going to do a, a small DIY with it, uh, clean it up really, really well. And uh, yeah, this will be beautiful. And last but not least, when I saw this piece, it brought tears to my eyes. I lost my mom a few years back, um, three years ago. And my mom was a berry picker. She picked strawberries, blueberries, gooseberries. She picked all the berries. And uh, we were very blessed to have a mom that would bring these fresh berries for us to hope, for us at home to eat. And uh, so I found this beautiful blueberry bucket. Um, this does not suit my decor at all, but possibly when I do my farmhouse uh, decor, I could manage to put it somewhere 
Uh, it just reminds me of my mom so much. I had to grab it, but look how beautiful this is. This is like a real wooden basket, it's like strips of, of wood. And um, I paid $2 for this piece. How perfect and gorgeous is this? It needs a good cleanup. Of course, look at all the dust but um, I'll dig in there with an old toothbrush and I'll get rid of all that. Well, that's it for this thrift store haul. This was a small but very good haul. I'm very excited about all these items. I can't wait to get my hands on these. Uh, I I'm, I'm just don't have enough hour in a run of a day to do everything that I want to do and to put out there for you guys to see. Uh, I'm doing my best to get them out as quick as I can. So bear with me. Stay tuned. If you like these items, give me the big thumbs up. This really helps me grow on my channel when you do the thumbs up uh, YouTube sees that you like uh, what I'm doing and then recommends me to people uh, let me know in the comments down below which item you think was a really must-have or was the best price or your favorite I'm curious I will always want to know what you guys are thinking and if you haven't had a chance to subscribe to my channel and you like what you see well, hit that subscribe button and join us for many, many more videos to come. Until next time, folks, you have yourself a wonderful day.